Welcome to Talk Times with Grimes. In the past, you've had only me on the screen talking about the school. Today is an opportunity to hear from one of our Year 12 students, Kate. Now, Kate's been here at the school since Year 7, so she's been at the school right through the senior school years. Uh, Kate's always impressed me for her positivity and the way she engages with other people, her leadership, and she's always someone to help younger students. So I thought today we'd talk to Kate a little bit about what she loves at the school and how she feels the school has changed her. So Kate, if you could think about how you've changed and grown over those six years, how do you think the college environment or all the programs offer, how do you think they've helped shape you to, to who you are? Year 10 Outward Bound was like a massive wake up call for me. Like I really started finding my leadership qualities there. That was an amazing experience. I made so many friends. I got close to so many people on that experience that I'd never really um, been close to in previous years. So yeah, that was probably one of the biggest things that shaped me. Okay. As you've gone through those, those years as being a teenager, have you experienced any challenges that you felt that you were supported by the school in? Oh, definitely. <laughs> yeah, basically halfway through year seven, I got diagnosed well, I, that I relapsed with aplastic anemia. The first time I had it for two years, remission for two years, relapsed for two years and was in remission for two years, um, which basically brought me to year 11 last year. And halfway through last year, I got diagnosed with a new disease called PNH. It's like aplastic anemia, but instead of being um, a disease that attacks all your cells, it just attacks your um, red cells, your hemoglobin. And knowing that I was having to go into year 12 fairly soon and deal with that was very hard to kind of comprehend. I came to school so I can, could try and fit in normally and um, still be with my friends. And it was great because I could still kind of take my mind off everything that was happening. but. If I, I didn't have the pressure of schoolwork, school was very supportive. They literally had a room for me where I'd go and sleep for two hours a day. I could just basically go up to anyone and be like, I'm having a bad day. Um, and they would just take me and sit me down and I'd just cry to them. Wonderful. If you could think about your fondest memory of your time at the school, what would it be? Um, I think my fondest memory would probably be here in year 12. We do mingling Mondays um, and I get to go up every lunch, Monday lunchtime and see um, a little group of year threes. Like we've made a little group and we do some colouring sometimes and I hear all the year three goss, it's great. Um, yeah, I love them, they're so sweet, so yeah. So what does that feel like when you're actually there with those year three students? Talk to me about that. You don't really have to worry about anything, you can relax, you, anyone's a friend um, and your littlest conflicts or problems is who gets to play on the playground and who gets to go on the swing mm -hmm. first. So yeah, I just love going back to that and they're so sweet. So It must be really nice to have the, the Year 3 students look up to you and do you realise when you're at that moment that you're actually giving something very special to them? Yeah, absolutely. They're so, like, they always... <laughs> fight to talk to me, like they're always trying to one-up each other Lovely. <laughs> with their stories and yeah, they're so sweet, so. <laughs> Wonderful. Well, Kate's only one of our Year 12 students, but one of our, the things that attracted me to, to come to the school many years ago was our students. In actual fact, it was one of the requirements I had of the board before I accepted the job, and that was to come and walk around the school and meet our young people. And after meeting our students, I decided this is the school for me to join because it's a school where the young people have been brought up with wonderful values. We attract the finest of, of families, families that believe in education, families that believe in traditional values. And it gives us the opportunity to have a genuine partnership with those families in raising the most amazing young people that we do. So whilst we've had a terrific conversation with Kate today, and uh, she's just about to head back to a maths class. Um, I thank you for joining us once again. Please don't forget, if there are topics that you would like me to talk about, please put those on our Facebook page, and I'll do my very best to, to, uh, to address you on those. And I hope you look forward to the next episode.